Save $10 on a Craftsman 7-piece metric wrench set and other Craftsman items, now only $9.99. And the four-pack of soft white LED light bulbs, buy one pack, get one pack free. Harris Ace will host a Neverhood Christmas party on Saturday, December 1st, with Santa making a special visit. Harris Ace Hardware, West Cherry Street in Jessup. When further treatment is no longer an option, hospice can provide services to manage symptoms and difficulties caused by illness. Emotional, psychosocial, and spiritual care, as well as support to the families and caregivers, are all part of hospice care. Hospice of South Georgia has been a part of the health community in Wayne and surrounding counties since 1998. The professional yet compassionate attention provided by our staff is unsurpassed. Widely supported by donations from the local population, Hospice of South Georgia is the local nonprofit hospice in Wayne County. Our administrative office is located at 1625 Sunset Boulevard and Hospice of South Georgia accepts anyone who meets hospice criteria regardless of their ability to pay. Please call 912-588-0080 to speak with someone about hospice care. That was 912-588-0080. We are your hometown hospice and we are here to serve you. Hospice of South Georgia working to add life to your days. This is Charles Huffman at Jessup Housing Outlet. If you haven't been to Jessup Housing Outlet lately, you're missing out on a large selection of new and exciting floor plans from the nation's top manufacturers like Clayton, Fleetwood, Scottbilt, and Homes of Merit. All of our homes feature modern kitchens and appliances, R60 and higher insulation values, thermal pane windows, and energy-efficient heat pumps. We have two locations to serve you, 2452 Savannah Highway in Jessup and Highway 301 South between I-16 and the bypass in Statesboro. Come see Charles Bay or Sheridan today. Whether it's a car accident, storm damage, or a fire, when the unthinkable happens, it doesn't matter if you saved money in 15 minutes. In this moment, it doesn't matter if your neighbor has the same insurance you do. In this moment, what matters is that your independent insurance agent and the company that stands behind them have you covered. Auto Owners Insurance, the no problem people. Call Rachel Carter, Dana Davis, Lynetta Baxley, Anna Pickren, Ron Cobb, or Jimmy Swain at James M. Swain and Associates Incorporated in Baxley, Georgia, or Cobb and Swain Insurance Agency in Hazelhurst, Georgia today at 912-367-3601 or 912-375-2520. Local news on WIFO. It's time now for the latest in local news. In the news, now that the governor's race has been decided, the race that still has to be decided in the runoff is the Office of Secretary of State. Early voting begins Monday, November 26th. will run through Friday, November 30th at the Wayne County Courthouse at the Registrar's Office. Office hours are 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. They'll be open during the lunch hour. If you have any questions about early voting, simply call the registrar's office at 427-5950. Again, only just one week of early voting in the runoff for Secretary of State. Runoff is between Republican Brad Raffensperger and Democrat John Barrow. Raffensperger received 49% of the vote to Barrow's 48.6%. Election date is Tuesday, December the 4th, with the polls opening that day at 7 a.m. and remaining open until 7 p.m. Again, only one week of early voting beginning Monday, November 26th. Once again, the time at the courthouse, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Again, they're open during the lunch hour for your convenience. Suspect believed to be responsible for Friday's fatal shooting and armed robbery at the Vidalia clothing store went before a judge Monday morning. Bond was denied. Toombs County Sheriff's Department has arrested 29-year-old Tyrone Burns, charged with felony and malice murder along with armed robbery. Burns is accused of walking into the R.J. Pope menswear store in Vidalia around 1 p.m. Friday afternoon, robbing the store at gunpoint. During the robbery, he shot and killed the store manager, 31-year-old Brooke Joyner, mother of a 7-year-old child. Prosecutors informed the court that Burns has a criminal record of 40 pages long from the state of Florida. Still faces charges there. He's out on release from those felony charges in the state of Florida. Has only one arrest in the state of Georgia, that for criminal trespassing. And prosecutors say they're considering seeking the death penalty in the case. Blood drive yesterday at Calvary Baptist Church, another one tomorrow at Wayne Memorial Hospital. The hospital's blood drive from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. The blood mobile adjacent to the exterior entrance of the cafe at Wayne Memorial Hospital. Appointments can be made by calling 1-800-RED-CROSS or visiting the redcrossblood.org website, entering WMH as a sponsor code. Walk-ins will be welcomed. All blood types are needed. Again, free long sleeve Red Cross American Red Cross T-shirts will be given out to donors while supplies last. Again, the blood drive tomorrow from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. in the blood mobile adjacent to the exterior entrance to the cafe at Wayne Memorial Hospital. We'll be back with more news after this word from our sponsor of the commercial messages, so please stay tuned. 
totally transparent car buying. With Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC live market pricing, know for certain you're buying at the low market price. We constantly monitor multiple auto and competitor websites to always offer the most aggressive market prices. No games, no gimmicks, no kidding. That's why Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC is the home of the no-hassle deal. Skip the runaround and discover the difference of truly transparent buying on every new and pre-owned vehicle every day. We're online just like you, and we continuously scan pricing on hundreds of vehicles to update prices in real time. At Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC, know for certain that our live market price is the low market price. Experience a new and totally transparent way to buy with live market pricing. Chevy, find new roads. Morton Collision is located at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton's offers free estimates, 23-hour towing, and they guarantee their work. Call 427-3769 or after hours, 912-294-6140. The staff at Morton Collision Center works with all insurance companies. So for guaranteed work with a qualified staff, go to Morton Collision at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton Collision, quality you can see. Do you need a new lawnmower? If so, head to Night Saw Company in Baxley. Choose from a large selection of name brand mowers. Night Saw Company offers the best lawnmowers at the best prices anywhere. They also have in stock belts, batteries, and parts for all mowers, along with name brand trimmers, blowers, and hedge trimmers. For over 50 years, Wayne Countyans have been getting their power lawn equipment and parts from Knights. Night Saw Company on the Jessup side of Baxley on Highway 341. Other news, the Wayne Reeds Train Literacy Fair is set for Tuesday, November 27th, a week from tonight from 5.30 to 7 p.m. at J.C. Stadium. They'll have train rides, food, game tents, entertainment by students all taking place, plus books to be handed out for those that attend. Middle school and high school students will be greeting to the younger children. If anyone would be interested in donating new or gently used children's or young adult books, simply contact Reggie Burgess at the board office at 427-1000, extension 390. Reminder, the Jessup City Council is going to hold a town hall meeting on Tuesday, November 27th at 6 p.m. at the Farmer's Market. Commissioners have been talking about a town hall meeting for several months. At their last city meeting voted to conduct a town hall meeting and invite the county commissioners and the public and have a discussion on issues of interest. Once again, the town hall meeting is set for a week from tonight, Tuesday, November 20th, 27th at 6 p.m. at the Farmer's Market. One item for discussion might be the Norfolk Trestle that spans U.S. Highway 84 and 1st Street. Some on the ward of commissioners appear to be in favor of painting the trestle, but others question the cost as the figure is over $100,000. That's the figure that's been stated. Mayor David Earl Keith explained the cost estimate came from City Engineer Bill Schumann for the painting based on the requirements from the railroad company that extensive safety and liability concerns be met, as well as specifications on the type of paint which will be used and other factors imposed by the railroad. First and foremost, City had to get permission from the railroad to paint the trestle. That hurdle has been reached. City Mayor and Manager have stated that they would like the county to help pitch in and help with some of the cost. Trestle has spanned the highway since the railroad was built prior to 1900. It's long been considered an eyesore in the city. At the last Tuesday regular meeting of the council, the item was tabled as several commissioners opposed to the project as a result of the cost. And that's just one topic that could be discussed at the town hall meeting on the 27th. The city also discussed and approved the tentative citywide cleanup, followed by a cookout at the farmer's market. That tentative date of the cleanup January 11th with the planning session scheduled for December the 18th. Again, the first of town hall meeting. Again, the council inviting the public and county commissioners to come and meet, have a discussion on several issues regarding the city of Jessup. Again, that town hall meeting set for a week from tonight at the Farmer's Market. We'll be back with some final news notes after this word from our sponsor, the commercial messages, so please stay tuned. Totally transparent car buying. With Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC live market pricing, know for certain you're buying at the low market price. We constantly monitor multiple auto and competitor websites to always offer the most aggressive market prices. No games, no gimmicks, no kidding. 
That's why Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC is the home of the no-hassle deal. Skip the runaround and discover the difference of truly transparent buying on every new and pre-owned vehicle every day. We're online just like you, and we continuously scan pricing on hundreds of vehicles to update prices in real time. At Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC, know for certain that our live market price is the low market price. Experience a new and totally transparent way to buy with live market pricing. Chevy, find new roads. Seasons change. Quality of service does it. For 75 years, First Franklin Financial has been serving the financial needs of your friends and neighbors. You can always depend on the caring staff to be there when you need them. Drop by and see your friendly Franklin folks at 1074 North Macon Street or give them a call at 427-4237 or apply online at 1FFC.com. All loans are subject to our liberal credit policy and limitations, if any. First Franklin Financial Corporation, NMLSR number 141654. Georgia Residential Mortgage License number 5656. When you have an accident, you, not the insurance company, chooses the body shop, and you only need one estimate. All you have to do is call Jerome Riles at BNC Collision Center in downtown Scriven to deal with the adjusters and insurance company. Whether it's a little ding or a major crash, that BNC Collision Center across from Wazden Cabinet Shop in Scriven deal with the insurance company so you don't have to. Call them at 579-2274. That's 579-2274. Final notes and news. Holidays quickly approaching. Wayne County will have several special events along with the Christmas shopping season that you'll want to mark on your calendars. Be sure to attend. Each year, the Altamont Baptist Church presents a live nativity at Westbury Park across from the Dairy Queen. Those dates set for Thursday and Friday, November 29th and 30th from 6 to 8 p.m. Always well attended in a special way to help celebrate the true meaning of Christmas. As always, we encourage everyone to shop at home this Christmas season. This Saturday, November 24th, is Small Business Saturday. The Wayne County Chamber of Commerce encourages everyone to shop local, support our hometown businesses. This is Saturday, November 24th, and every day of the year. And all the area merchants having big sales on Black Friday. Chamber of Commerce Christmas Parade set for Saturday, December 1st in downtown Jessup. Theme of Christmas lights and winter nights. You still have time to get entry into the parade. Simply call the chamber at 427-2028. Then the following Saturday, December 14th, City of Scriving having Christmas in the park from 6 p.m. until bounce houses, horse and buggy rides. They'll also have 42,000 pounds of snow at Veterans Park beside City Hall. Fire pits and s'mores, hot chocolate, lighting of the Christmas tree, a Christmas movie, Christmas caroling, free admission. They do ask the kids under 12 be accompanied by an adult. And that's Saturday, December 14th. DDA is hosting photos with Santa on November 29th and 30th. Also on December 7th at Cafe Euro and Jessup. November 29th from 7 to 9, November 30th from 6 to 8, and December 7th from 6 to 8 p.m. DDA also having Holly Jolly First Fridays on December 7th from 5 to 8 with Christmas activities such as ornament making, cookie decorating, and more. If you need more information on that event, call the DDA at 427-1313. Annual Wayne County Toy Drive still underway. Again, if you'd like to make monetary donations, make the check payable to Wayne County Toy Drive. Drop it off at City Hall. Also, there are a lot of Boxes around at various businesses. Again, they ask you to drop off the toys in those boxes. If you need any more information about the toy drive, simply contact Tracy Smith at 427-1313. Toys can be dropped off through December the 7th. Wayne County toy drive applications can be obtained at Jessup City Hall. Deadline for all applications is Monday, December the 3rd. That's going to do it for the latest in local news. Sports comes your way in a few minutes. Bob Morgan, Center have a great day. You've been listening to local news on WIFO. For all your medical needs, Tim's Home Medical on South First Street in Jessup has you covered. Oxygen, CPAP equipment, wheelchairs, walkers, hospital beds, plus specialty medical equipment from a local company that cares. Tim's Home Medical can handle Medicare, Medicaid, and private insurance billing, as well as family records for tax purposes. Tim's Home Medical, owned and operated by Tim Sloan, 918 South First Street in Jessup. Tim's Home Medical. Call 385-2490, 385-2490. Visit Western Sizzlin and Jessup on Thanksgiving Day for a homestyle meal that includes all of your favorite dishes like turkey and dressing, glazed ham, green bean casserole, and much more. Just think, no cooking, no dishes, no hassles. You get the best part of Thanksgiving Day time with your family and friends without all the fuss. 
Western Sizzlin' special Thanksgiving dinner served from 1030 until 230. Gotta get to Western Sizzlin'. Western Sizzlin' on the corner of First Street and Sunset yeah. Boulevard in Jessup. Good morning, everyone. Don't be surprised by a little patchy fog or some low clouds early on this morning. Don't worry, they won't be around all day. Gradually, sunshine returns. Highs today will be close to 70 with clear skies tonight. For tomorrow, our midweek forecast will be sunny. Highs will be in the mid-60s. And for Thanksgiving Day, sunshine and highs in the mid-60s. I'm Georgia meteorologist Laura Huckabee in the GNN Weather Center. And then a Monkey Walker Jones. At Walker Jones Honda, we won't wait for Black Friday to give you the best deal on a new Honda. Because we've got Black Friday deals all month long. Right now, get rates as low as 1.9% on Honda's best models. 1.9% on sporty Honda CRVs. 1.9% on Honda Civic. And rates as low as 1.9% on the 2018 North American Car of the Year, the incredible Honda Accord. Plus, we'll take care of you like friends and good neighbors should. Because Walker Jones is the home of the lifetime warranty at no extra charge to you. Lifetime. So don't wait for Black Friday to make your best deal on a new Honda. Hurry in for Black Friday deals right now at Walker Jones Honda. Memorial Drive in Waycross and online at walkerjoneshonda.com. Get the best deal from Walker Jones. W-I-F-O-F-M, Big Dog Country. It's time to check your birthdays and anniversaries. Brought to you today by Barton Power Sports. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday wishes today going out to Terry Bowie today. Terry Bowie with lots of love from Mindy and Madison. Terry Bowie from Mindy and Madison. Happy birthday to Terry Bowie today. Mary Grace Groover is uh, celebrating. That was yesterday for Mary Grace Groover. Happy 10th birthday for Mama, Papa, and Keredith for Mary Grace Groover. It says the birthday is Monday, November 19th. So that was yesterday for Mary Grace Groover. Happy 10th birthday. Dylan, wait a minute. Happy birthday, Daddy. We love you from Dylan and Autumn Hargrove. 39 today for... Daddy from Dylan and Autumn Hargrove. Uh, so I don't know who Daddy, Har- uh, other than it's Mr. Hargrove from Dylan and Autumn today. 39 years old. Happy birthday, Daddy. We love you from Dylan and Autumn today. Sonia Carter celebrating. Sonia Carter, happy birthday. Charles Dent as well. Charles Dent, birthday wishes. And then Wanda Jordan, Wanda Jordan, happy birthday from Robin Eubank State Farm Insurance this morning for Sonia Carter, Charles Dent, and Wanda Jordan. Long County Calendar on the 20th. Wes Johnson, Roy Howard celebrating. Ainsley Dawson, Ainsley Dawson, Ray L. Howard, Ray L. Howard, and Harrison Mako, Harrison Mako. So Wes Johnson, Roy Howard, Ainsley Dawson, Ray L. Howard, and Harrison Mako. Happy birthday. That is the Long County Calendar this morning. Textosos at 912-427-3711. You've got time to shoot one in right now. Always kind of a slow week as people turn the Thanksgiving week into a vacation week for a lot of folks, especially with school being off. Happy birthday to Justice Barber. Beautiful girl turns 12 years old today. Love always, Mom and Dad. Justice Barber is 12. Justice Barber, 12 years old. Okay, those are all yesterday, so that's it for Textosos. 912-427-3711. You've got time to shoot one in right now. Birthdays and anniversaries, as always, brought to you by Bargeron Power Sports. Famous birthdays today, actress Veronica Hamill, Hill Street Blues, is 75. Find my client, Thurla, or I swear I'll have you up in charges. Masterpiece Theater's Alistair Cook was born in 1908. Hello there, and welcome to Masterpiece Theater. Me, Alistair Cookie. Today, we're going to see that thrilling and stirring story and richard dawson was born in 1932 name an occupation in which you disguise your appearance a doctor <laughs> name a yellow fruit orange <laughs> still the best family feud host that was richard dawson happy birthday michael from dylan and autumn michael from dylan and autumn is that michael hargrove is that is that who that is yes from dylan and autumn so that is uh, michael 
Hargrove. Happy birthday from Dylan and Autumn today via text at 912-427-3711. All right, uh, you've got time while we go to break the send in via text. We're going to cut away for Barge and Power Sports. Come back with your big dog country birthday cake winner. We'll do that right after this. Barge and Power Sports invites everyone to come visit their unbelievable new showroom on Highway 301 South in Jessup and on Highway 341 in Brunswick. They have a great selection of ATVs, golf carts, mowers, and more. Barge and Power Sports carries Arctic Cat four-wheelers and side-by-sides, the new popular Canyon four-wheelers and side-by-sides, cruise carts, and Yamaha golf carts. Bargeman's has the full line of Kimco scooters. Don't forget, Bargeman Power Sports offers a complete service department for all your service and repair needs. Stop by today and check out Bargeman Power Sports, Highway 301 South in Jessup, and their new location on Highway 341 next to I-95 in Brunswick. Your Big Dog Country birthday cake winner on this Tuesday morning. Happy 12th birthday to Justice Barber, who picks up the cake from the Jessup Piggly Wiggly Bakery. That certificate is here at the station. You come by, you pick that up. It's good for today. Only head to the pig and claim your prize. Bargeman Power Sports, Brunswick, Jessup, online, bargemanpowersports.com, bringing you birthdays and anniversaries. We're wishing Justice Barber happy 12th birthday, the Big Dog Country birthday cake winner on this Tuesday morning. Well, happy Thanksgiving from all of us here at FM 105.5 WIFO as we head towards uh, the Thursday holiday. We'll be closed Thursday and Friday back to work on Monday. Like I say, a lot of people take this as a vacation week. Good morning to WIFO at 731. Happy birthday. Justice Barber, 12 years old, picks up the cake from the Jessup Piggly Wiggly Bakery. All right, at 731, let's get a look at your GNN Weather Center forecast. Good morning, everyone. Don't be surprised by a little patchy fog or some low clouds early on this morning. Don't worry, they won't be around all day. Gradually, sunshine returns. Highs today will be close to 70 with clear skies tonight. For tomorrow, our midweek forecast will be sunny. Highs will be in the mid-60s. And for Thanksgiving Day, sunshine and highs in the mid-60s. I'm Georgia meteorologist Laura Huckabee in the GNN Weather Center. River level 9.5 feet projected to crest at uh, 10.7. 9.5 and rising river level. Low tide this morning in about four hours at 1147. High this afternoon, 547, 6.7 feet. Sunset at 526. Temperatures in the mid-50s. 57 Chevy here at the Big Dog WIFO. That is your GNN Weather Center forecast on FM 105.5. 7.32, good morning from the Big Dog WIFO. It is time to check in with state news from GNN. Brought to you this morning by England's Mobile Glass and England's Collision Center. England's Collision Center and Mobile Glass has been providing our community with quality collision repairs for over 20 years we work with everyone from self-pay clients to all insurance companies england's mobile glass has all the windshield services for you we offer chip repairs windshield replacement and seal repairs for those pesky leaks 